All right, so we're pairing this MHK2 thermostat with the second air handler of four at this home. So we just put in the battery. We have this little sensor up there that has connect. Right, we'll click on the connect button, which will then start to flash green. First it's amber, which means please wait. Then it will turn into green and slowly blink. Now I will, here. I will, I will connect and it's gonna take 30 seconds to connect and the, the flashing light will start to increase speed. When it increases speed, it means it's in pairing mode. So it's pairing right now with this receiver or thermostat, whatever, whatever term you wanna use. Once it's completed with that pairing, it's going to be a solid green light. So now it's at success on the thermostat. I'm gonna click done. And now we have to do the programming. So this is start setup. You click start setup now. On this here, you're gonna to go to, there's a, um, let, let me go grab the another room, one second. Where's the uh, manual for the configuration? Here, it's this one here. Oh, here it is. So 134 will be on page on the installer setup. So we're gonna have a central controller. We're gonna click on not installed, go next. Fahrenheit is what we want. We want heat pump option since this does heating and cooling. Then we have, we're gonna deactivate the auto because if one of the air handlers is on heat and the others are on cool, it's gonna generate an error code. So we're gonna click edit, we're gonna click manual, and then we're gonna click done. Then we're gonna go to, again to the 151, which is a schedule type five days and then weekend. Then you have schedule off periods, disabled, residential, disabled, disabled, disabled. So all that stuff can be referenced right here. We've already did this on the first one, so we're just kind of coming right through. Max heat 88, minimum cool 61. MHK2 is a temperature source. 191 is a indoor temperature offset, zero, and then humidities. The MHK2 offset zero, finish setup, select. Now, this is gonna save the settings that we just did. We're gonna put May 29th. Wish it had a Wi Fi in it, that'd be so cool. Now, we're gonna click on the 12 hour format, select. Now I'm going to change the time to 11.02. Saving. Okay. Now we're going to check up there the status light. What is it? Is it flashing? Yep. Now click one more time to finalize the pairing. Is it solid green? Not yet. Just click it once. Yep. Okay, good. So solid green means that the pairing process has now concluded. So this is paired to this uh, air handler. What we're gonna do is now we're gonna um, test it by putting on mode. We're gonna put it on cool. And we're gonna drop down the temperature just to make sure it operates it there. So it's controlling it perfectly. So now I'm gonna go ahead and put it in off mode for the time being, and I'm going to remove the batteries while we pair the other two remaining units of the overall four zones. Thank you.